What's going on everyone? Connor here from Gear Reviews bringing you another video. Today we are looking at how to make a camp coffee using the Bialetti Mocha Pot 9 cup. So I'm just going to show you quickly how you set it up, what you need to prepare. So make sure you click the subscribe button and the bell down below so that you get notifications for all my new videos. But for now, let's check out how to make a good cup of camp coffee. All right, so first you take your bottom basin. You will take the funnel and then fill it with your ground coffee. You can either have pre-ground or grind your own before you go. And you just fill it up to be about three quarters full. It's right about there, just to give it a bit of extra space. You don't want it to be overflowing and you kind of level it off, just shaking it. You don't tap on it at all. And then what I will say is you do need to have your water already pre-boiled to fill the bottom basin. That just makes it a better tasting coffee. It's just a good way to make uh, coffee using the mocha pot. It's what I've seen online and what I've sort of found out. So you just fill it up with water. You fill it up right to around that pressure valve line right on there. Then you bring it back over. You put your funnel thing of coffee back in and screw on the top part. Now make sure you use a glove or towel as that bottom will be really hot with the boiled water in it. All right, so you're going to then need to relight your stove just to sort of boil the water a little to let it pass up through the coffee. So you just put it right on top on sort of a medium boil. You don't want it to be a very high heat. So Usually you will just leave the lid open a bit to sort of be able to see how it's progressing and how well it's coming out. So as you can see, it's right there. It's on that lower to medium heat, just so you don't burn the water, as I said. I'm gonna turn it up just a little bit. So it's gonna take a bit of time to boil, but as you can see, it's already coming out through the top, which is really, you know, it's nice that it doesn't take too long and you can see it's coming out of a good stream and now it's starting to speed up. That's when you want to close the lid and take it off of the heat. And obviously you'll turn off your burner. You can see the steam there from the frost that's on the picnic table. It helps as you are supposed to cool it down after so none of the burnt water gets through. But there you can see the last little bit coming out. There you are and your mocha pot's all done and ready. So that was a how-to on making camp coffee. I find it's a nice simple approach and makes a nice cup of coffee. It is a little bit stronger, which is sometimes needed, especially when you're camping in the cold. I hope you all enjoyed the video and maybe you'll try out making a mocha pot on your next camping adventure. Make sure you click the subscribe button so that you can see all my new content, more from my camping trip and all the other videos that I'm going to post. I hope you're all doing well, and we'll see you all later.